Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing PyAlert, a network intrusion monitor. To get started, launch a terminal and run sudo apt update and upgrade to install available software updates. Then we'll use apt install to install a few prerequisite packages, as well as the web and database components required for PyAlert. We'll use sudo apt clean to free the space that's being used by the app package cache. Now we'll use wget to download the latest PyAlert release. Then using the make dir command, we'll create directories for PyAlert in the web root and logs directories. We'll extract the downloaded PyAlert tar file to the web directory and set ownership to the www data group. Next, we'll run a few commands to update hard-coded paths in pyalert.conf. Then we'll import the cron jobs that PyAlert uses to scan the network. We'll create a symbolic link to the PyAlert front end to make it accessible from a web browser. Then we'll copy the PyAlert site configuration for Lite HTTPD and create a symbolic link to enable the new site configuration. And lastly, we'll enable PHP support in Lite HTTPD. Then restart the service for the change to take effect. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host slash PyAlert. Welcome to PyAlert, installed natively on your Linux device. The PyAlert cron job runs once every 5 minutes, so it'll take a few minutes before network devices start showing in the UI.